looking for a load of you to bring your heel on the rail so we're looking to almost split you can see there's a, there's a let's say that's the v right here and we're going to split this axis of leverage with this axis of balance and it takes the foot almost back to when it was a gripping foot most of the information we see out there is based on flat surfaces but it's not like the foot evolved on linear surfaces and linear environment and was traditionally a climbing foot so it has this gripping ability this will help rebalance the ankle and put the ankle more of in a neutral position so another one for the kids really is to even stand just resting with their body weight over the balls of their feet. The parents out there have concerns about their kids that they've taken them out of shoes and they can see that the big toes drifted in. You know, rail work will certainly start to help open the big toe. So I only really see this whole pronation and collapsed ankle when kids are standing with their knees fully extended and their weight rocking back in their heels. And the moment they start to understand where to distribute their weight through here, and the front of the foot, let's say, all the metatarsal heads and remove so much weight from the heel, the ankle starts to pick up.